Hey guys, so I'm back from grocery shopping. Uh, the Uber, not Uber, Lyft driver, she was nice. It was a lady. I didn't feel nervous or anything. She was talking to me and then I was quiet. I loved it. I went to Dollar Tree first and then I went to Walmart. Meanwhile, there's a dollar store right across from Walmart. I didn't know. So I told her, she's like, okay, fine, fine. And then she's like, so are you going to give me cash? And I've been telling her I'm going to give her cash. She's trying to tell me that she doesn't really speak English because she's new. She's been here for a year or so. She's Spanish, but she's good. I thought me and her were going to have an argument because the way she was talking to me. And I'm like, I have to repeat. So everything I told her to wait for me to go to Walmart and then from Walmart. I didn't know she added. I thought I was just going to pay like less. She So from Walmart to, no, from Dollar Tree to Walmart and then home to, from Walmart to home. It only cost me 12 bucks and that's not bad. I was like, damn. Then I, so I gave her 13. I was like, okay, let me give her a dollar tip. Then I felt bad because like she's actually helped me with my groceries, like put my groceries on the cart or whatever. It's wet, she doesn't care. She's driving in the rain. I was like, hey, let me just give her an extra tip, 20. And I give her a big, she's like, oh wow. Cause I'm like, hey, this is extra 13. She's like, why 13? Cause it's supposed to be 12 something. She's looking at me like, why 13? No, it was 11, so 12. And then I, yeah, so it was like $12 or 13. I gave her 13, I think. And then I gave her a big tip of 20. And then now on Lyft is saying, oh, Saying right here, you'll see it. This is her name. It says, Hey Julianne, thanks for my riding with Marina. Let the driver know how you appreciate the driver by adding a tip. I already gave her a big tip. Like, I don't have money, but like, I felt like she was so nice enough to wait for me. I kept saying, I'm sorry that uh, I was running late or whatever. She's looking at me like I'm crazy. She's like, It's whatever. So I told her I'm here for a week and she's looking at me like wow because I came with big grocery bags and I love Walmart because they were nice helpful the lady oh before I waited for my driver she didn't know where I was going because my location was giving some different location but then I looked at it too it said the Royal Palms so when I put the address it was giving the other other hotel called Imperial whatever Imperial I'll put it down here so yeah and then I texted her because it says you can call because I remember one of my coworkers or other people use Uber, especially my coworkers. They were showing you how you could t call or text them and show them where to go. So I texted her and I was like, oh, wow, this shit works. So I love the Lyft so far. I just used my credit card because three years ago, you could say how I used to be of CIPC. Somebody used my stuff to get Uber like so many times and then CIPC didn't call me. Tell me there was a fraud. I had to go to them like five times or like ten, you could say, and then start cussing and being ratchet that's what they want black people to do but you know uh that's what i had to do be ratchet and whatever and they finally closed my account and then now i'm a bimo so i use my bimo credit card okay i'm going off topic if you guys just want to know about that story time comment down below and i'll tell you how twice or just yeah twice that happened to me but like just this one one conversation i'm talking about how somebody wanted my account and they took my money they were spending money like anyhow and they basically ran out my bank account almost because i caught it in time but yeah just comment down below and then i'll let you know what is wrong with my camera i thought it's a seven minutes not take three but anyways i'll let you know about that story time okay so these are the stuff i bought about the bellhop i'm just gonna put these away and then i'm gonna put the bellhop thing your way whatever the cart whatever how you call it you ready know like i don't know i feel like i bought extra stuff that i don't need like i was already putting back um paper plates because i was like okay hey, I'm, I'm gonna need paper plates i'm disgusted about how i had to what is it called use their fork and knife Ugh. but then i went to the front desk and i asked about the housekeeping and they said i don't get housekeeping but if i need anything that's why i guess there's a number here to call housekeeping which is where let me show you Y'all see it where it says housekeeping? Let me point there. I don't get housekeeping this whole week. They said it's not part of my package. I'm like, what? So I just gotta be extra careful and I gotta do this like it's my house, like treat it like it's my actual house, clean it. So I'm worrying about limiting the garbage because if you guys see the garbage right now, I run out of paper towels, whatever. But he, the front desk said if I need anything from the housekeeping, they can call and then housekeeping can fix it. So I thought it's going to be an extra charge. Like I said, is it going to be extra charge? It's looking at me like crazy. It's like, no. 
So this is a garbage right now. I know I'm disgusting, but I'm disgusting for showing you. I'm not saying I'm disgusting in general. So this is garbage. I'm trying to limit it. Like, I use a lot of paper. There's a food disposable, but I don't use that because I live in a house still. I don't believe in house dis um, house disposable. Food disposable. I only believe in um, recycling and all that, like organic waste and See all the green bin where you put the food? That I believe in, but like, have a disposable in the sink, nah. Mm -mm. Then I watched too many movies and shows where people did it and then it got caught. <laughs> their face, no, not their face, their hand and shit, nah. Okay, so I'm going to, you're gonna see me load up the groceries. I clearly suck at recording. I tried to record me going back and forth, but it didn't work, so. I got water. I didn't even know they had it until I looked online. I was like, Walmart. I'm I'm pretty sure they have this in Canada, but I don't do these things with my family because it's like distilled water to me. It's disgusting. Distilled water, so I don't do that. And then I was looking online, it showed that different type of water they have. I was like, hey, I can get the Nivea at the dollar store. And clearly, again, states and Canada is different. So they don't have the water bottle at a Oh, they don't have the Nivea water bottle here because it's different. So I was like, okay, let me get water. So I looked at, they still have the distilled water. I'm like, ugh. So I remember when I looked online at um, Walmart, they had this kind. So I was like, okay, this is like regular water. I hate Nestle. I love Kirkland. So they have different type of water, but I already know Nestle is great. Nestle is like my second water now. Like Kirkland's the best. So I just like, okay, let me get this. And then this is the last one. So I got two. I got a bootleg one, which was Walmart water. It's called Great Life. So I was like, let me just get the two. I don't know which one's a dollar. So I just got this. I didn't even check the ounces. I should have, but I was like, fuck it. And that still tastes great. So this is going into my fridge. Um, Clumsy me, I bought pop. I love pop. I'm sorry. I don't know if it's going to finish in time. I have coke in here already. I needed Canada dry because I'm feeling sick so this is two dollars which is cheaper a dollar twenty five so you could say two dollars or like one forty not bad because the Canada um not the Canada the Coca-Cola I bought yesterday from the store was three dollars like an idiot and then I bought fruit punch like I love juice I can I can have juice at home I, as you guys know but I'm trying to cut down on juice and then if I bring the juice home that's gonna finish in like in two minutes. Like everybody gonna done it off. So that's why I just drink water. Water is there for life. So I bought Arizona fruit punch and it was 80 cents. I was like, okay. Especially because in the morning I'm gonna need um orange juice drink. I looked at the orange juice price. <laughs> Five something for like a Tropicana and stuff. I was like, okay, they're gonna have the dollar store. They didn't have a dollar tree. I don't know what you guys are saying, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, like it ain't popping like Maybe because of the Dollar Tree I went to, that's probably why it wasn't popping. I don't know. It just wasn't popping for me. It just looked like a rundown dollar store, like the bootleg versions we have in Toronto. I don't even think they have that anymore. So I bought four of these. Who told me to buy four? Mm -hmm. So like, let's see how much I spent on these because these are 80 cents, right? So 80 times four, right? And then I don't know how much the GST costs. So it says 3.0. Oh my god, I spent three dollars on this shit. Yeah, I spent three dollars. I'm crazy. And then I could have just well they don't have a drink for three. If they do, it's like a lower drink. I don't know, I'm crazy. I could have just bought nah, they don't. I could have just bought two. And then I don't know, I'm crazy. For this, I'm mad about how I spent that type of money. And then I bought, I don't even know what it's called. The guy was looking at me like I was crazy. Not crazy, just like looking at me like, these are called trays, he called it. It's called something else, but I don't remember. So I bought this. I'm trying to break it, and I'm, I'm an idiot, because I should stop this out myself, sorry. I was taking it apart, because I thought it was one. Because in Toronto, you won't get it like this. If you do, you're lucky. But like, it comes in two. I thought it was just one. So it's 80 cents, I believe, or 89 cents. I bought two of this. I could just put my chicken and my meat in there. I mean, they do have, but I'm 
tired of the grease and stuff when I can just throw this out when I'm done. Y'all know me, I'm cheap. I don't care. I bought this. This sour cream onion. I love sour cream onion. Um, this is a bootleg version. I don't care. Because their chips are jack high. I don't need all that. Salt. I only need a little salt, but the smaller salt is like three something. I ain't trying to pay three something. When I got this for like a dollar, so yeah. Oh, this is the receipt right here. So this one, this is black pepper. I got black pepper. They don't have black pepper, the one that I want, because in Toronto, I should say Toronto where I'm from. Um, they have black pepper, but like it's powder. This is not powder. They had one in the plastic bag, like the 99 cent one, but that was a lot of money. No, it was 99 cents, but it was big, like chunks of black pepper, and I'm like, nah, this one looks like it's smaller. This one's expensive, but I love black pepper, so I need it. I need seasoning on my food. Um, the black pepper costs two forty eight, and I'm mad. I'm fucking mad. Then I got onion, and then on the way home, this is my home, I don't care. I was like, I don't need that much onions, what's wrong with me? Because I'm probably just going to make only rice. I don't need that much. But then I'm thinking maybe I could just make food, less amount of food and put it in the fridge, and then come back the next day and do a fresh type of food. But then I'm thinking now, like, I won't have time. Because when I go to playlist, I'm probably going to be there all day and then rushing home, and then I'm going to be like, oh, I'm hungry. Who's standing to cook? So I might have to do like pre prep the food. So this cost me it's three yellow onions. This cost me two forty four. I was gonna buy one big onion, but I'm like, nah, I probably need more. I feel like this is one from where I go grocery shopping. I don't know. So there's four, there's five in here. I'm gonna get this bag because you know onions, how they get dirty. I don't know why I bought I bought this. I was just like, oh I need meat, like I love meat and I I cut down on it but I feel like I need to cut down on it more because meat is actually not good for you. So I asked the guy, I'm like what is this because I really don't know what this is. I'm going to search for it now. It was stinking. Let me see what, the, what this is called. I don't know what it was and I just bought it. I know it's beef but then it says beef be so mad if I bought something I bought something basically what I don't know. <laughs> oh it's ground meat I don't know how to pronounce it don't make fun of me I spent 11.45 on it I don't care I don't know what that is I'm like it looks good it looks good. I don't eat this so it's like it's just grounded meat <laughs> but it is it's called mince or mince meats outside of North America basically meat Grounded meat. Okay, so it's something that I would eat. Like, okay, good. And then I got I'm like an idiot. Well, technically I am an idiot because why do I need things? I don't know why I'm thinking like I'm living here forever. I got wings. These are already cooked. So I just gotta put it in the oven, I believe. Chicken rice. I don't know. I was just like, okay, if I need something quick to eat, I might have to give some of these foods away. I don't know. So these are wings. It's called Tyson. I'll get my one. I know it's like, it's the best seller. Well, online is saying that. Then I bought parsley. You gotta have parsley in your food. Parsley flakes. I think this is the one that my mom had. I don't know. It was this and something else. I gotta remember the names. So it was this. This is what my mom has at home. Uh, I got vegetables, frozen. I don't like this kind. I like the kind that we have in Toronto. Like there's a specific brand. We don't have it here. I don't know what the brand is called at home. I just pick it up and I go. I bought, I bought two, just in case. I bought salad. They don't have the salad that I want. I want fresh salad. They had that at Milford's. I forgot what it was called too. I just, when I see it, I look at it, I'm like, okay, that's the one. So there was like different kinds of salads over there. And one said cabbage, or I don't know. I'm not thinking cabbage. So it said romaine lettuce. I'm like, I love romaine. 
This does not look appealing to me, but I need salad in my life. Like, I barely even eat salad now. Like, I need to get back on that. Um, I have salad dressing. Dressing. I have crouton there. So, now, so this is like all freezer stuff. Well, this is a fridge. I didn't even look up the date. So I just picked it up. That's what we were gonna do when we buy stuff. Right? Look at the damn date. Look at the date. Um. I want to, so now I'm gonna take out the Dollar Tree stuff. I was gonna say Dollar Rama because we have Dollar Rama. We have Dollar Tree too, but I'm telling you, our Dollar Tree is popping. Well, the ones I I know, but yeah. Anyways, so I bought a straw. I got, I'm tired of giving out of a cup. One fifty. I'm probably gonna run out of this. I shouldn't have bought the cup. I'm so dumb. I shouldn't have bought the cup. I should have. What is it called? I should have just bought the straw only. Those cups and save money, but whatever. I have cups for 16. I didn't even know it was 16. I thought it was 20, but whatever. I can run out of this in like five minutes. I bought this because it says heavy duty sponge or pads. This is what we have at home, but it's better. We have a better one. We don't have this one, like the actual crunchy kind. This will help me scrub out the grease and other stuff. So, yeah. Hopefully, I can that one out. I bought lip balm because I forgot mine like an idiot. And this is the only one that I saw. So yeah. And then I bought a nail clipper. I don't need it, but um actually I do need need it. This is tuna clipper. I do need it. I need to cut my nails because they're nasty. Um I still need to take out the acrylics from here because I ripped it off myself. Because I did acrylics on my natural nails. I was like, what is that smell? That's onion. I don't know why it stinks like that. Ugh. And then I looked in here, had the I don't know what is in here. Like there's it looks like a knife, but it's not a knife. I'm gonna scrape off those things. And then like an idiot. I saw Welchers and I'm like, oh, I have to have it. I have to have it. Cause it's a drink, it's food crunch. I'm like, fuck it. Then I saw this and this was the last one. It was kinda open, but I closed it and I feel like this one's better because it was more inside than the yellow one so yeah this is a healthy chef granola non-stick cooking oil that i got from dollar store so hopefully i don't get sick because dollar store stuff mm. then i bought palm leaf i bought another one because i have one here i feel like wasting money I'm wasting money but then when i wash i use a lot of soap so yeah and that's it for my grocery haul i hope you guys enjoy this video i don't have to cook tonight <laughs> because i still have leftovers so this is the fridge i was looking at it what the odds hmm. this is how the fridge is looking like wait you can't even see there there's my fried rice and then um coca-cola i was gonna kind of go out but nah forget it it's raining so yeah i have to go back and put the what is it called the trolley and then i'll get back to you guys well, as i'm putting my food away and i'll show you how the fridge looks like and then i'll show you outside of the balcony or whatever that's called the patio the backyard because i never showed you it okay bye y'all